Hi everyone! Today, we're going to study total probability. A sequence of occurrences of events in sample space S is E sub 1, E sub 2, E sub 3, up to E sub n. There are some points to remember here. Number 1. E sub i intersect E sub j is an empty set. The subscripts i is not equal to the subscript j. And the subscripts i and j equals 1, 2, 3, up to n. Second point, E sub 1 union E sub 2 union E sub 3 union up to union E sub n equals the sample space. Point number 3, P or the probability of all events is positive. We let capital A be any event. Now the total probability of capital A is denoted as P of A. Here is the formula. P of A equals the summation of I equals 1 up to N. This is P of E sub I times P of A given E sub I. If we expand this, we may write P of E sub 1 times P of A given E sub 1. Then plus P of E sub 2 times P of A given E sub 2 plus P of E sub 3 times P of A given E sub 3 plus up to P of E sub N times P of A given E sub N. Let us see example 1. A coin is tossed with a weight of probability of head equals 3 over 4 and probability of tail equals 1 over 4. When a head appears, a number is chosen at random from 1 through 9. When a tail appears, a number is chosen at random from 1 through 7. Find the probability of getting an even number. Let capital E be the event that the even number is obtained. Let us write the given. Probability of H equals 3 over 4. Probability of T or tail equals 1 over 4. Now, the probability of E given H is 4 over 9. There are 4 even numbers from the numbers from 1 through 9. So the probability is 4 over 9. Now, the probability of E given T equals 3 over 7. We know that there are 3 even numbers from the numbers 1 through 7. So we write here 3 over 7. Now for the P of E, the total probability for E, the formula is P of H times P of E given H plus P of T times P of E given T. Let us substitute the corresponding values. We have now 3 over 4 times 4 over 9 plus 
1 over 4 times 3 over 7. Let us simplify the first pair of fractions. We can cancel this 4 and 4. And this 3 over 9, we can simplify into 1 over 3. Plus, 1 fourth times 3 over 7 equals 3 over 28. So the sum of 1 third and this 3 over 28 equals 37 over 84. This is the final answer. Example 2. Suppose there are 3 bolt producing machines, M sub 1, M sub 2, and M sub 3, in different capacity like 30%, 20%, and 50% respectively. The machines also produce defective bolts, 5%, 3%, and 2% respectively of their productions. If a bolt is taken out randomly, what is the probability of getting a defective bolt? We let capital E denotes the outcome that the bolt is defective. So the total probability, and we write P of E, is this formula. P of M sub 1 times P of E, given M sub 1, plus P of M sub 2 times P of E, given M sub 2, plus P of M sub 3 times P of E, given M sub 3. Substituting the corresponding values, we have now 30% times 5%. So we write here 0 0.30 times 0 0.05, plus 20% times 3%. So we have here 0 0.20 times 0 0.03 plus 50% times 2%. So we write 0 0.50 times 0 0.02. Getting the corresponding products, we have now 0 0.015 plus 0 0.060 plus 0 0.010 and the total here is 0 0.085 this is the final answer this is the total probability i hope you learned something from this video see you again next time